everything, just the trees and the flowers and the birds, uh, insects and things like that. Catamount's mission and our goal is to be the premier education institute as it relates back to environmental aid education in our community. I learned about um, the environment and if and about the trees. If we if there's no trees on earth, we wouldn't be here at all. Catamount offers a variety of programs anywhere, especially in school ages from K to 12 and even into college level courses. Uh, we have programs called Keepers of the Water, which is really for grade school kids, teaching water and water ecology to children. We also have a program called YES, which are Young Environmental Stewards, teaching kids about the environment using science. To have a place like this where we can begin to develop the critical thinking skills, the problem solving skills, uh, collaboration, uh, you know, that whole, uh, that just whole piece of what it's going to take to survive in the 21st century. And these are things that uh, our district really believes in. And when we bring our students to a setting like this, it really is so conducive to nurture and bring all of those skills out in students. And this is something that we're striving as a district, as well as Catamount, you know, to put into our kids. And we feel like it's so important to have these skills. Many of the kids we, we serve are socioeconomically challenged. They live maybe at the base of Pikes Peak, but they've never been up on Pikes Peak. They may live a few miles away from the zoo, and they've never been to the zoo. They may have opportunities right down the road, but they've never been in the woods before. And what a great learning tool that has to offer, where they're engaging their minds, engaging their bodies to accomplish something. And what an important task that is for our future generations. Having a program like Catamount in the school is just, it's such an eye-opener um, from what they typically see in their everyday life and it gives them opportunities that they don't normally have. They don't have people to take them to the zoo. They live in apartment complexes or motel rooms where it's completely unsafe and they can't go outside and play on the street. Um, they don't have, you know, someone to take them camping on the weekends. A lot of times they're coming from single family households and mom's working all day and they have to take care of younger brothers and sisters so they can't go do the things that kids from more um, middle income and higher income families can do. They don't have those luxuries. And Catamount provides them with all the opportunities that everyone else has in their childhood. It goes way beyond some of just what we're teaching children. It's actually about giving children their childhood back to them. And what an important factor that is. We've gone rock climbing and we've been hiking and we've just done a lot of fun stuff and we've learned wilderness skills and so it was fun. The zoo. Oh, we got to touch a snake and we got to feed a hawk so that was really cool. What we're lacking is funding. We need high quality certified teachers at Catamount Institute. The word is out about our programs. Unfortunately, and to a very disservice to our community, we are turning away schools every year that are requesting our services and our programs. We need to grow the number of schools that we're involved with. We need to be able to give these youth their childhood back to them. Our goal is quite simple. It is to impact the entire community. And if we have to, we do this one school at a time and one child at a time. Without the funding, our impact is limited. At this point in our society and our community, it is crucial that we're developing the critical minds of tomorrow. And a better way to do this is through our programs. There's a need for our services and our education throughout the entire community. Teachers tell us that. Superintendents tell us that. Community members tell us that, parents tell us that how important and what effect we're having. Um, but to be honest with you, we're only just beginning. We've got a long way to go. Um, we're very tenacious, we're very hardworking, we're very stubborn. Well, this camp was really awesome. I mean, we did all this fun stuff, so if any kid wants to try this, it's so much fun, so. I want to do it again, because it was really fun and I had um, a great experience of nature. It's a great idea for this camp to learn about wilderness and stuff, because um, you can learn a lot of stuff about um, nature that you didn't think about before, and um, it's best because
because if you respect nature more, then you wouldn't want to destroy it.